all parts of the brain communicate and interact with each other. You are not destined by your genes or hardwiring to be on your path for uh, the rest of your life. A new science has emerged that enables all people to create the reality they choose. Rewiring your mental emotional circuits brings with it a simple but powerful message. What you think today will determine how you will live tomorrow. I say this again. What you think today will determine how you will live tomorrow. Get the power to let go of negative beliefs and embrace the positive. These smart, informative and hands-on exercises will help you to be uh, your best free self. Embrace emotional freedom. If you always knew that there was more to you than you've learned at school, uh, but let yourself be intimidated by high-tech savvy language, then this is the fine work you have been waiting for. How to change the world through power recall. This type of work takes real dedication, but the work gives you the essential tools. It is an unusually clear synthesis of theory and practice that can make a real difference to those willing to do the necessary work. So here is storytelling. Here's a list of words that has returned. So let me see if I can still recite them. So as you see, I'm closing my eyes, so I can't read it off. So that it was um, chocolate, potatoes, soap, milk, paper towels, coconut, banana, cheese, wine, bread. So I'm going to read it off now. Chocolate, potatoes, soap, milk, paper towels, coconut, bananas, cheese, wine, bread. So this is what I said. So here's an imaginary story that links each item into a memorable picture. Imagine opening a box of expensive chocolates, only to discover to your horror that each one has been uh, replaced with a potato. You investigate the matter, matter further by starting to peel one of those potatoes, and you discover when you bite, bite into it, um, it is made out of soap. Ugh and you need to get rid of the taste out of your mouth. So you take a long drink of milk, but unfortunately the carton has a leak and the milk is pouring out. And you try to mop it up with paper towels, but it's no good. The level is rising fast. Sitting on top of the towel rail is a coconut. And as you watch it, it grows and grows and grows until it's big enough for you to sit in on and to, uh, and, and to float on top of the milk. A banana floats by and you fix it on, on your coconut boat uh, as a mast. And when a triangular piece of cheese you can find on, on board uh, as a sail, you use it as a sail. And you find a bottle of red wine on board and you use that to paint a colorful sign on your sail. Unfortunately, you've been a bit rough though. And a number of holes have been torn into the sail, which you try to patch up with pieces of bread. So remember the items by simply going back through the whole story in your mind, link by link, and write them down, each item as it appears. So it began with a box of chocolates. Inside, there were potatoes, and then it turned out to be made out of soap. And you tried to get rid of the terrible taste with milk, but the carton leaked, and uh, you used paper towels to mop it up in vain. As the milk level rose, you used a huge coconut boat and fixed it with a banana mass and a cheese sail. And you painted the sail with wine, carrying it in the process, and the story ended with you repairing the holes with pieces of bread. So it might help filming the strange events. Your mind's eye becomes a camera, able to zoom in on all the key details and move with action and explore everything as, it, as it's going on. So when you replay the mental film, you'll be able to recreate all the details of the story.